Good evening, Norm Silverdick, 70 Tymon Road, representing the uh, rational taxpayers of Hampton. <clears throat> there has been considerable uh, communication going back before Chairman Waddell and members of our organization, Jerry Zanoy for one, and um, independently Richard Nichols regarding the wastewater treatment plant. We as an organization uh, are recognize the need to have the wastewater treatment plant capital expenditures that are most necessary be completed for the town and for its present and for its future requirements. We have a significant issue with the impact of the BODs caused by um, Smutty Nose and I think it's been uh, concluded that Smutty Nose is the, is, has been the source of the increase in the BOD and as a result approximately six million of the 13.9 million capital expenditures attributable, attributable to them and now that they are in bankruptcy per se and the assets are being auctioned off the agreement between the town and Smutty Nose is going to wind up being null and void with any new buyer who buys the assets because I don't think anybody's going to step into the shoes and buy their uh, the liabilities that they own Provident Bank. So they're going to, whoever the new buyer is, if they buy the business in its entirety, will have to come to the town and renegotiate a uh, wastewater treatment uh, plant permit and we think that the taxpayers should not be paying for this. It should be passed on to the um, industrial user who's been perpetrating the spike in the BOD and the cost of this increase in capital expenditures. We can support a much smaller bond issue, one that meets the, uh, the most urgent requirements of the wastewater treatment plant. We think that the whole area of the BOD spike needs to be analyzed carefully and then put in sort of a phase two approach and then uh, so that the taxpayers can get behind this so that they can support the bill. And in our situation as a taxpayer um, watchdog group, we are, again, I want to emphasize, we support the capital requirements for the wastewater treatment plant. We don't support spending money on something that will not become an immediate problem. Because with Smutty Nose, and I can't see anybody stepping up to fill their shoes and to, uh, to, uh, to buy the asset in the entirety without coming to the town. If they come to the town, then the town has the opportunity to negotiate a really good deal with them to pay for the cost. So I just want to uh, ask you, I know you're going to be discussing this tonight, to consider this very carefully and to uh, consider reducing the amount of the bonds so everybody can get behind it. If it continues to be at uh, $13.8 million, then uh, we will oppose it in, in as that amount of money. We'll, we will support a bill for a much smaller amount. I just want to let you know that. Thank you very much for your time. Thank you.